Welcome to the Aquarius Samples video series. My name is Dave Gilby. I'm a water quality analyst at Aquatic Informatics. First, let me briefly introduce our company. Aquatic Informatics is an award-winning software company based in Vancouver, British Columbia. We have a development office in Hobart, Australia and staff around the world. Our vision at Aquatic Informatics is to build the best solutions to manage the world's environmental data. Aquarius is today's leading software suite to acquire, process, model, and publish water quantity and quality data. Over 500 environmental monitoring agencies worldwide trust Aquarius to produce accurate, timely water information. In this video series, I'll provide an overview of Aquarius Samples, a powerful software-as-a-service solution that streamlines the production and management of environmental lab and field sample data. To save time, while increasing the quality of the final data. You'll see how discrete water, air, soil, biological, or tissue data can be securely stored and validated online for rapid analysis and visualization, so you can make better decisions anytime, anywhere. Let me now introduce Aquarius Samples with a brief overview of the system. First today, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go through uh, getting into Aquarius Samples and signing in via my Google account and showing uh, some generalized workflows on the initial landing page. Some things to know about Aquarius Samples, each organization gets their own unique database and with that comes its unique URI, which I've highlighted here in the address bar. You should also know that there's help available at any point. Uh, it's all web-based, so all you need to do is click here and go to the help section. The help is also contextualized based on what page you're on. So for instance, if you're in the laboratory portion, laboratory report portion of the application, and you click help, it's gonna take you to that portion of the help. Um, this is an administrator uh, icon here that takes you to uh, the names of the uh, named users in your Aquarius samples account. And let's go through some of the generalized workflows. So you'll see on the screen here, this is a generalized workflow for most, most organizations. This, some, this uh, fits their day-to-day -day workflow. Uh, locations is um, primarily to set up the spatial relationship of your data, your discrete data, to a spatial location that you're trying to represent. Field trips are aggregations of field data collection activities at a specific site. Field visits are those individual data collection activities at a single site. And from there, those uh, field visits are split into many different data types that are being collected. One is field measurements, your standard taking a, a meter reading with a probe, um, something with a, a field kit, or getting a value from the field as a field result. So the result is actually generated in the field. We also have the traditional uh, sample and specimen collection. So if you're going out and sampling the water column and pouring those samples into bottles, we have a, we will do a deep dive today into Aquarius samples and specimens, uh, as well as the organizational information that surrounds the laboratories that you use. So you can direct your samples to the right entity managing those lab reports and how we can search and filter on those lab reports. And all this data is rolled up into what we call an observation. And an observation is anything that you can measure or observe in the field. So this could be the result of a water chemistry measurement. It could be an observation of a tree height in the field. It could be some chemical results of fish tissue. That concludes our brief overview of Aquarius samples. Be sure to watch our next video to learn how to access, filter, and visualize all of your field and lab data online in one easy-to-use system. Thanks for watching.